preparing for it was uh, really physically I, like exhausting. I would, I, I would use the word exhausting because that's like the only word that really explains like devastatingly tired, but not yeah. negatively exhausting. Like it was still really fun. Hey everyone, this is Anna Rimmer with Pop Culture. And today I have with us Bible Stewart to discuss Apple TV Plus's new series, Roar, premiering April 15th. Welcome. Hi, thank you for having me. Thanks for being here. Can you first tell us a little bit about what it was that drew you to this project? Yeah, for sure. Um, well, first and foremost, the script. Uh, the, I mean, you know, I don't get sent the the full script for an audition, but even just getting the sides was very, uh, I was already so taken by what I was reading. So definitely the writing. Um and then hearing who was attached to it and who was directing it and the writers of it, uh, I was fully on board. And just being involved in a period in a Western, you know, like you don't see someone who looks like me, uh, female or my race being a lead of a Western. So that was uh, really changing, you know, and, and horseback riding. Like I grew up horseback riding and and I've only been acting for like six years, you know, I've been in the industry forever, but, but not really, I never thought horseback riding and acting would collide. So, right. so many, so many, so many things. Well, I was about to ask, you know, what was it about uh, taking on a Western and kind of making it your own uh, that was so appealing and what was it like filming yeah. it? Yeah. I mean, filming it was, I feel like you can ask everyone that was on the crew. <laughs> it, was, it was like 112 degrees and we were oh, gosh. in Santa Clarita. And I mean, Kara Hayward, who plays Millie, she had to wear like a full on like corset and the skirt and the full getup. And I had to wear, you know, and the material was uh, accurate to the material in that period. Oh, so gosh. it was like thick. Yeah. I mean, so filming it was, it was was definitely a thing um, <laughs> preparing for it was uh, really physically I, like exhausting. I would, I, I would use the word exhausting because that's like the only word that really explains like devastatingly tired, but not <laughs> negatively exhausting. Like it was still really fun. Yeah. I mean, it was beautiful surroundings at least. <laughs> yeah, for sure. And it felt like I had watched an entire movie by the end of just, you know, like 30 mm -hmm. minutes. What was yeah. it like filming such uh, a big story in such small amount of time? Yeah. I mean, I feel like if someone else had gotten the script and only had a week and a half to like really, you know, uh, become the character, that would be hard. But I think since I guess I got lucky with the seven weeks prior of horseback riding training, so I could really like feel what it would be like to be Jane. I had multiple dress rehearsals, um, with a hat, with the, I had a gun, I went gun training. So I think with all of the, the layers on top, not even just with filming for a week and a half, it felt like I was filming a full length feature film. So connecting to the character was, wasn't hard. Oh, that's awesome. Well, I can't wait for everyone to see your episode and I appreciate you talking with me today. Thank you so much.